today we are going to go for another little sail, um, probably also to some anchorage where we're going to spend the night and then probably come back. And the guys just started the motor, which we always do for safety to get out of the harbor. But yeah, then later we will turn the engine off. And right now we have almost no wind, but there are yeah, some rain clouds coming. We will see, probably the wind will pick up a little more. But it's also nice to practice with low wind because then you can make mistakes. And yeah, I'm really excited in this <laughs> red working suit here. So down there in the engine room there are a lot of things to check after you turn on the motor. Oil pressure, water pressure, leaks, smoke, all kinds of things so that you're sure that your motor is not gonna die on you out on the ocean but we would have still be safe but yeah and also there's a salt water cooling system for the motor and the fresh water cooling system so a lot of systems that could leak or there could be some problem and we do these test runs sailing in this fjord to an anchorage and back to test the boat and to learn and to get experience start a sailing journey in the direction of Portugal we will still see if Portugal stays our goal but we definitely want to leave this place and start to properly sail but yeah last times that these people went out sailing always something was breaking and then we had to come back fix it try it again something else breaks and now we're right now really lucky that nothing major is broken so could be the perfect time and slowly we are getting there to make this ship really sailable again. Now there's no wind, so unless you want to just practice putting that up, we'll just go out and maybe go over. No, but you still may want to use it. It's on auto it's to run this, this uh, part of the thing. Right. So now the rain died down again and still some pretty yeah, fascinating clouds around here and now we decided to take our little dinghy and go to the shore for a little hike. So really excited about that and Dave thank you so much for all the teaching today.
So now we are docking our dinghy here. We're going for a little beautiful hike. Almost everywhere here in Denmark you have water and it's beautiful. Little harbors like this, it's amazing. Sun just came out again and now we are hiking here in this beautiful lush green landscape with all the fresh leaves of spring and over there this cozy little house and then our labora sitting there it's just wonderful absolutely wonderful oh the swamp here it's amazing how you can be inside of this forest and it's so green and kind of raining and it's like a building and here is like like a huge concert hall or something that is a completely different world from out there where there's basically the ocean and water and the ship wow what an amazing place wow now look at this place there's like this huge sand and gravel bank going out from the land into this yard and you have water on all the sides it's amazing and over there in the distance our labora anchored that's beautiful. skiff to the labora it was a beautiful hike and the water is so calm right now with the sunshine just amazing and by the way this is Marcus from Spain living since seven years in Germany now our newest crew member on the labora welcome and the best one yeah yeah <laughs> yeah probably you are <laughs> nice to have you Now we're having a little nice barbecue here in the back deck where there's a little gas stove and that's because mainly we want to do we want 
because mainly we don't uh, want to use <laughs> our so main handy. stove, the stove that is electric. <laughs> and there we have some nice stuff. And then over there, we can see the fog rising from the fjord, which is really beautiful. And on the background, you got Julie. Yeah, that's pretty nice. That's lovely. Yeah, we have some beers. Beers. <laughs> you know I'm German. <laughs> yeah, we have actually dark beers. Really nice. Some nice food. Nice people. Really nice. Jules! Old ghost is doing some tricky stuff. 